exactly 10 minutes from now. First pitch at 515. It's going to be beautiful. 71 degrees. I think that's just perfect weather. By the time the game's done, it's going to be around 65 degrees. And overall, just an amazing day for baseball. Go Dodgers. We're looking at LAX right now. Blue skies, barely seeing a cloud in the sky out here at LAX. About 66 degrees at the airport with the wind coming to us at around 13 miles an hour, that westerly wind. We're tracking some high pressure that's around our area, but the good news is we'll still see these cool temperatures stick with us at Make least sure for the next the few days, Subscribe. but we do have a change in our forecast. I'll show you when we, we can expect that warm up and also expecting some light rain chances as well coming up in just a few minutes. Okay, Niku, thank you. Our friend, the great pumpkin in Irvine. Absolutely love this shot. The town definitely has that Halloween spirit going on and you can see the kids in the background playing soccer too. Perfect weather for that. About 71 degrees in Irvine. Very light winds coming to us at around two miles an hour. Here's a live look out in Glendale and you can see the palm trees. It's a little breezy out here. Just winds, uh, southerly winds, just a little under 10 miles an hour and it's looking really nice out here too. Around 74 degrees, sunny skies. Same thing by the beach as well. This is the Santa Monica Pier. Beautiful forecast there. We're looking at a high right now of around 67 degrees. It will be chilly by tonight. Hopefully you guys have a light sweater if you are by the beaches. We're not tracking anything too crazy at this time. Everything is on track with the forecast uh, pretty much all over our area. Looking at some pretty normal temperatures for this time of year as well. And even in uh, some spots, slightly cooler too. What we're really keeping our eye on is that onshore flow and that marine layer that we've been looking at for just the past few days, all that fog in the morning. That's going to stick with us at least for the next couple of days into early next week. But by mid next week, things are going to really change. So we have that high pressure also settling in and the onshore flow is going to turn more offshore flow. So that high pressure will really dominate and bring our temperatures up, even though we do have that marine layer. So take advantage of these cooler fall like temperatures because in a few days they're going to be cranking right back on up. We're looking at lows tonight in the 40s forecast. You can see today and tomorrow mid to upper 70s, but a big drop in temperatures from Monday into Tuesday and the 70s will stick with us. But as we head into Wednesday, because of that marine layer, there's going to be a 10% chance of drizzle at least for the majority of next week. But then as we head into next weekend, that's when that high pressure really starts to take over and we see those temperatures cranking back up into the upper 70s and 80s. Valleys and inland empire, we are seeing triple digit streak that we had for Palm Springs. Now their high is going to be around 98 pretty much almost every single day this week. Good looking forecast 80s in the deserts down to the 70s. But like I said, as we look into next weekend, temperatures will crank back on up into the 80s. Michelle and Jory.